What's up there Vintage Speed fans? Um, we're here today in Wendover Wood. Um, we're with the Wolfsburg Boss Crew in the UK. We're going to be checking out some builds. Um, people who have Vintage Speed products, we're going to be asking them what they think. So stay tuned. Wolfsburg Bus Crew is um, a UK based club with members all across uh, Europe, uh, mainly air cooled T1s, T2s, and T3s. We go to lots of events throughout the UK, um, representing the air cooled community, organising events like this um, for all the club members, and go to some of the big shows throughout the UK and Europe. If you'd like to know anything more about us, you can check us out at wolfsburgbuscrew.uk. Take it easy. So we've had the bus about all four or five years now, um, always messed around with air-cooled vehicles and usually one of the first things you always find when driving these things is the um, shifting can be a bit like stirring porridge. So um, yeah, one of the first upgrades I did was to select the vintage speed shifter, having looked around at a few other things on the market and um, seeing what the competition was like. I like the, the stock look and the stock feel of the vintage speed shifter. It doesn't look out of place, it doesn't look um, sort of subjective. Yeah, so the main thing I like about this is the stock look and feel. It's a nice shift. It feels like it was part of the bus should have been when it was originally built. Um, it doesn't look out of place. It feels really nice and it gives that really sharp shift when you're changing gear. Um, and it gives you that response when you need it, which you don't get with that stock shifter, unfortunately. Um, and obviously from my perspective, it fits nice with the bus. It doesn't look out of place. 